Hey everyone, so there seems to be a lot of confusion over how to install and use the new premium fonts that Silhouette has now offered in their store. And um, I want to show you where you can find them, how you can download and install those, and then use those in your projects. So what you see here on my screen is an example of one of the new premium fonts, and it doesn't really show you that on the store account screen or the store shopping screen. And I'm doing this from within my software here. One thing that you can do is you can actually click on the actual item and it's going to take you into the description of it. And you can see in bold red letters that the Silhouette um, company is telling you that this must be downloaded and installed manually. It's not going to work like some of their other fonts um, for example, the ones that start with ZP or PN um, <clears throat> and, and things of, of that nature. So um, what you want to do is put this in your cart, purchase it the way that you normally would, whether you have a personal or commu commercial use license, and then go through that purchase portion. When you're finished with that, the normal things will download to your library and you'll get um, an option to see the premium font in your library as well, except the font is not yet installed. So there's an extra step that's necessary to be able to use this in the software. So there's a couple of ways that you can do this. When you purchase a premium font, you will have a notification under this new bell icon. And it's going to show you your recent purchase includes downloadable content and you're going to click on that and you can see that um, for whatever reason that little screen flashed and then went away and it's just hidden behind other windows so you'll look down at the bottom of your screen for the secondary window that popped up and you can maximize this however you need and then scroll through your content here looking for the font that you just purchased. Okay, so you can see that I've purchased this Happy Ocean font and it gives you a box to check that says download. So you'll check that box, scroll back to the top of that list, and you have a button that says download now. So when you click download now, it's preparing your download and you should now have this window here that pops up that says, what do you want to do with this? Do you want to open this file? or do you want to save this? Again, if you don't see this, if it happens to be hidden by another screen, just look down at the bottom of your screen here to see if there's perhaps something um, hiding it, okay? If you choose to open it, then that's going to give you the opportunity to open and install that font. If you choose to save, then it's going to give you an option to choose where to save. And by default, it's going to show you exactly where, on the left side, where that's going to go. Okay, so you can see that it doesn't really even give it a name, it just gives it a number. But it's a compressed, zipped folder. So this means that it's going to work just like you found a font on the font, where you have to extract it and then install the font. Okay, I'm going to cancel out of this. <clears throat> If you choose to open it, then another window opens and you can see that I now have two files in here. One is the actual font and then the license. Double click on the zip file or you can try to extract it. It's your choice on how you want to do that. And then you can double click on the font file and you can see that it opens it up where you can then install that particular font. Okay, once this install button grays out, the font has now been installed to your computer and you can use it in any software, not just Silhouette, but any software where you can type text, okay? And then you can just close out of those files, close out of those folders, close out of your download screen, you can clear your notification, I'm not going to do that because I have one more in there I know that I need to download, or you can just close out of it and go back to it later. Now, in your library, it's going to show you in your fonts, let's see, what was that, Happy Ocean? 
that it's available to use. However, it's going to show you at this point that the file type you are attempting to access is not supported. Okay, a couple of things here. If you had the software open while you were installing the font, you would need to close out of the software and reopen it, just like you would on any font install, okay? Um, the other thing is sometimes those premium fonts just need to be selected from the font style window, okay? And you can see it's not in my list here yet because I haven't closed out of the software or reopened um, to, to have that show up in my list here. So just keep those things in mind. If you have the software open while you're installing the fonts, close out of it, reopen, and then it should be there. Hopefully this helps um, kind of clear up that confusion on how those work. Um, if not, feel free to give me a, um, a message, leave a comment, and um, we'll go from there. Thanks, guys.